It's Wednesday, so that means it's time for another DQ Day. I once again update you on my efforts to be the first at the Westlock Dairy Queen when it opens. As always, you can help me out by signing my petition at change.org. You can find links at the Real Country 97.9 Facebook and Twitter pages. Firstly, my apologies for not giving you an update last week. I was off on vacation getting my Christmas shopping done, but I managed to keep DQ Day in my heart. I found myself at West Edmonton Mall last Wednesday, where I treated myself to a Swiss mushroom grill burger in the food court. But looking in on the petition now, I see we're at 83 signatures. So, as always, thank you for signing my petition and keep spreading it around. Looking in on the construction site, not much has changed in the past two weeks, but something did catch my eye. In addition to those beautiful spoon-shaped door handles, I see they've hung their first bits of advertising. There are some posters on the side of the building showcasing the blizzards and their chicken strips. Today we enjoy the pictures and tomorrow we dine. Check out my pictures on Twitter and Instagram, just search the hashtag DQWatch. So while I was away, apparently an interloper decided to muscle in on my territory. It's been brought to my attention that a second petition has been started up and is starting to make the rounds. I've checked it out and all I can say is it's not that serious. His entire reason for wanting to do it is because this is a meme, I guess. Well, let me read from my petition and why I want to be first. No one is more excited about Dairy Queen than me. I have many fond memories of Dairy Queen. Growing up in an even smaller town called Entwistle, a stop by Dairy Queen was always the highlight of any trip to the city. Going to see a movie? The experience was complete with a blizzard on the drive home. Birthday on the horizon? Well, that means a special trip for an ice cream cake. I drive by that construction site for the Westlock Dairy Queen every day. I have taken to chronicling its construction. Upon looking at my latest photos, a friend commented, With all you're going through, they really should make you the first customer. So here we are. That is a much more valid reason than... This is a meme, I guess. So accept no substitutes. Sign my petition so this one true diehard Dairy Queen fan can be the first. And as always, before I wrap this up, let's spin the wheel of excuses. People always ask why I'm doing this instead of just standing in line. What's my excuse this week? In this day and age, it's not what you know, but who you know. I'm just trying to catch the eye of those who know. And that'll do it for this week's DQ Day. Once again, thank you for helping me in my efforts to be the first at the Westlock Dairy Queen. Help me out by signing my petition at change.org. You can find the links at the Real Country 97.9 Facebook and Twitter pages.